In an effort to slow the spread of COVID-19 in Sioux Falls, on Tuesday, the City Council will be taking a look at two ordinances they've already seen. Two councilors are hoping to bring them back to develop a surge plan for the city. Kettleland's Lauren Solik joins us now with a look ahead. Good evening, Lauren. Good evening, Bridget. Councilors Janet Brecky and Pat Starr are bringing two ordinances forward on Tuesday. One of them is an ordinance the council just saw last week but didn't pass. It's an emergency ordinance to require face coverings in an indoor public place where six feet of social distancing can't happen. The other ordinance is one the city had in place earlier this year, a no lingering ordinance. This would institute social distancing or a capacity limit for certain businesses. Brecky and Starr also want to work with the city to develop a funding plan for helping businesses impacted by those regulations. We have to have a surge plan and that's what I'm proposing. Let's fund the messaging, let's get the financial, um, you know, finances in place to help the, 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 the let's get the financials in place to help uh, the entities that are going to have to shut down and then let's get the mask ordinance in place because we need people to wear masks now. The ordinances are set to go through their first readings on Tuesday. Tonight on Kelloland Weekend News, we'll bring you a closer look at the plan Councilors Brecky and Starr are bringing forward to the City Council.